Hey everyone, I'm Lauren Stone with Toy Wizards, that's toy-wizards.com, and I'm back for another spontaneous toy review. And today's item is, I'm always saying it, I start every video, and today's item is so cool, but today's item is so cool. Guys, I managed to get um, this, this, this. This is the uh, Dennis Nedry in the Barbasol Can Entertainment Earth Convention Exclusive. And what a battle it was to get this. Obviously, in t here now in 2020, there are no events. So everything that was supposed to be either a like a San Diego Comic Con exclusive or a general on tour convention exclusive um, was all repurposed for online sales. Some companies did their own. Here's the Mezco Con, or here's San Diego Comic Con at home, or here is Super Seven Stay at Home Con. So whether they sold them online or they made their own con, that was up to the discretion of the individual companies. But with this little beauty here, it was a, again, Entertainment Earth Convention exclusive. So what did it look like to buy an exclusive online? Well, the website crashed and it took me 50 minutes, five zero, 50 minutes to buy this thing. I didn't think I was going to be able to. I think what had happened is that Entertainment Earth had like bot blockers, so as soon as there was this mad rush um, to procure this thing, then basically it crashed their website and nobody could get one and then like 45 minutes, 50 minutes later, finally everything returned back to normal. I gave it one last shot and I managed to get one and now it is sold out. This, this toy was only $20, how do you say no to that? original Jurassic Park packaging and of course we are going to open this toy. I have really fond memories, like many of you, not even just in my age group, <laughs> I'm 35, but in general um, of Jurassic Park, the franchise is fantastic. I specifically remember with Jurassic Park, it was the first movie that was under my radar where people pulled their kids out of school. I was in second grade, 1992, when this movie came out, and I just remember, like, I'm not even kidding, it was at least a few kids every week where their parents pulled them out of school, like, before or after lunch to go see Jurassic Park, and it became this, like, weird ritual for every, for, I can't embellish and say every, but it became this, like, weird ritual for a bunch of kids in my class whose parents would just pull them out of school to go see Jurassic Park. I'm guessing it's because after school and evening shows were packed. So <laughs> I was like, that's status, man. Like if your parents are cool enough to pull you out of school to go see Jurassic Park, I'm like, this movie must be magic. And I did, of course, I saw it, you know, not in theaters. I saw it about two years later on videotape because that's how long it took for things Old, old lady rant. That's how long it took for things to get on from theater to video. It was years. And you guys know what I'm talking about. There were certain movies that took years. And I felt like Jurassic Park was one of them. I might have just been really excited to see it. Specifically with the Dennis Nedry character. But uh, it was just refreshing. And they're like, Nedry is an anagram of nerdy. I'm like, gee, clever. You don't say, really. Um, and it's funny because is he is he really Dennis Nedry or is it Newman? Like I'm excited to crack this open and see if I actually just bought a Newman action figure. This is not the only time this action figure is being used. You can still I'll link it below. I'll link it in the description below. Who doesn't love saying that? I'll link it in the description below but you can still buy the Jurassic Park Amber Collection Dennis Nedry and that one is I want to say it's going for about $26.99 you can still actively get it it has the two faces so you have default Dennis Nedry and then you have you know acid in the face it, it burns Dennis Nedry so let's take a look at this get out of here get out of here oh there are instructions so here's the contents of the box. <gasps> oh my gosh. Beard Buster Barbasol Thick and Rich Shaving Cream Original. 
Oh my god. This is crazy. I love, and this is by Mattel. Mattel made this toy. Mattel has the Jurassic Park license, and I hope that it, I hope it fully supports them. All right. <laughs> One, to play, turn the can to reveal the figure and for lights and sound. Press the top when the figure is revealed for more lights and sound. Has batteries, AAA, screwdriver, because as much as 90s as this is, this is not a 90s toy. I was talking about children's toys recently, and yeah, they're all smart. They have, they, they're all safe with screws, and that's how you get the batteries in and out. You can tell when something's actually a 90s toy, because those battery things just pop right open. Okay, I just removed a piece of plastic, so that's gonna activate the lights and sound. Oh my gosh. This is, so this is crazy, okay. First look, he's little. Yeah, this is about a four or five inch um, action figure. How do we get the? Oh my god. Uh-uh-uh. You didn't say the magic word. <laughs> I am so happy. I'm such a nerd. <laughs> oh my god, he's such a creep. I love it. Newman. Hot jambalaya. <laughs> oh my god, this is such a cool toy. The Dennis Nedry um, Amber Collection toy, I want to say, is a larger scale. It might be in the six or seven inch range. Totally unappreciated in my time. And he said, I'm totally unappreciated in my time. Let's see what this guy comes with. Some trivia. Some trivia about Dennis Nedry. Because Spielberg worked on both The Goonies and, and uh, Jurassic Park. Theory has it that all of his costumes... And he really didn't get much screen time before he met his demise. They were really quick to kill characters. I know Jurassic Park's a book, and I know Dennis Andrew dies. Just saying, they were really quick to kill off characters in, uh, in older movies. I feel like that trope is not as active. I feel like people need to be, they need to be Sailor Mooned and healed or learned their lesson. So unlike the Amber Collection, this does not have um, a second face for Dennis Nedry, but look, at, you are gonna see, look at this, look at this sculpt, look at this toy. Look at that. Oh my God, those 90s glasses and those 90s, and those 90s jeans. Here are his accessories. We have a satchel. His, I guess it's a briefcase, Merce, man bag. You know, it's been a minute for me since I've had a new Mattel toy. Um, I've played with a couple Barbies here and there, but not action figures. Even my new Masters of the Universe review, I did not actually open Evil Lynn. And I maintain that I am not going to open Evil Lynn. Was that new for 2020 text on it? And new ones might not. And I'm not gonna, whoop, I'm not gonna risk anything. Look, it's a little piece of pie. Um, num 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 nums. And of course, we have the famed Barbasol can. Isn't that adorable? Itsy bitsy bitsies. Which means I gotta keep it away from my kids. I'm keeping this whole toy away from my kids. Why would I even have, why would I let my kids anywhere near this? I like the articulation here. Yeah, he, his head moves, his arms move, knees move, everything seems to be in working order. I'm gonna keep his Barbasol and his pie right there. I'm gonna see if he can make the... You didn't say the magic word. Top? It sounds very different when you um, open it up and he goes, uh, 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 you didn't say the magic word, versus when you press down. I have no wonder you're extinct. That's like very different sound quality, and I'm not complaining, I'm just pointing it out. This is very different sound quality when you press it. Okay. Look at Cheap Mommy Dyson. I totally unappreciated my time. Oh my god. Uh, 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 you didn't say the magic word. Yeah, I feel like that's just a completely different sound bite. I totally unappreciated my time. 
but I'll take it. Dodson! Dodson! We've got Dodson here! This is hilarious. Don't get cheap on me, Dodson. Don't get cheap on me, Dodson. And the one you expect. Woo hoo 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 hoo! Ah ah ah! You didn't say the magic word! Oh my god. Is that too cool or what? Yeah, I mean, it's. I'm always saying it. What an amazing time to be a toy collector. Everybody from Jurassic Park, you think of all those characters, and at one point in time, it would have been all of them getting a toy first. But we've hit this point in pop culture where we know who we want. We want Newman. Don't get cheap on me, Dodson. That's right. So I just wanted to take some time and show you guys this super cool toy. The presentation is phenomenal. These lights, the sound audio quality is honestly fantastic. And $20. What convention exclusive cost 20? How did that happen? How did I, I bought it like a big girl. Like this wasn't any sort of like toy journalist favoritism. Like I, I, I did the right thing, man. Money came out of my freaking pants and turned into Newman, okay? So yeah, this was super cool. And no wonder you're extinct. No wonder you're extinct. So thank you guys again for joining me. I'm Lauren Stone with Toy Wizards. That's toy-wizards.com. Visit the site daily for toy news, reviews, articles, listicles, snarkticles, editorials, opinion pieces, all sorts of bits and pieces about collecting, toy everything. And thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and stick with us because we have more amazing things in the pipeline. All right? Be safe, be good, be cool, be awesome, and I will catch you soon, okay? Bye! Can you go? I thought you said you were going to leave me alone 10 minutes.